Happy Christmas. If it's your first time here, welcome. If it's not your first time, thanks for coming back. So, I've asked for Christmas songs, and I got a big list of them. So this is one that I that I chose. Now, this is from Diana, and it's a cover of What a Wonderful World. Now, some people would debate whether or not this is a Christmas song, because uh, I guess the lyrics aren't fully Christmassy, but you know what? I you hear it all the time around this time of year, uh, Christmas and New Year. So I'm going to count it. Now, it looks like it's a... Um, Diana and who is it? Something Stone. Brandon Stone. I don't know who Brandon Stone is, but I'm gonna find out. All right, I don't need to babble. Headphones up with a melon. Like, subscribe, do all that YouTubey stuff. Help me out with those algorithm gods. I greatly appreciate it. And let's check out what a cover of "What a Wonderful World," right? Brandon Stone right there. Summer light. I see trees of green, red roses too. I see them bloom for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. I see skies of blue and clouds of white The bright blessed day, the dark sacred night And I think to myself, what a wonderful world She just has a way of relaxing you of the rainbow so pretty in the sky or else on the faces of people going by I see from chicken hands saying how do you do Cry. I watch them grow. They learn much more than I ever know. And I think to myself, what a wonderful. That was unique. 
I really like that. Totally different. Bravo. What a totally unique take on the song. I really enjoyed it. I've never heard it uh, covered anything like that. First of all, you, you have Diana's, uh, Diana's voice, which is really relaxing. I say that every time I, I do a video on her and, or yeah, any of her music. It just puts you into a zone. It chills you out, kind of hypnotizes you. So that was cool. But then you mix it up with a little scat and a little jazz tempo. That was really cool. I enjoyed that cover. I, I, I enjoyed that a lot. I wonder if this is available on Spotify. I'll add it to my Spotify playlist. This was a really cool cover. You know what's unique? Well, I've been saying forever, her voice is so unique, but you really, really recognize it when she does a cover that you've heard over and over again from multiple artists. Everybody's done this song, right? Of course, a lot of people associate it mostly with Louis Armstrong, which that's my favorite version also. But then, you know, there's so many different versions of it, and you're used to all these different, you've heard all these different voices. And then when and when, when she does it, automatically you're like, wow, this is so different. It was just, it just shows how unique her voice is. I guess that's a long way of saying that. Thank you. If you were one of the people that recommended this song, I appreciate it. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you. Happy Christmas, and I'll see you soon.